Hey, guys, sorry, I'm just about to head off. Oh, and I'm just dropping Wilder off. He's got bike duty with Louis. But yeah, he did talk about something about fuel line or something. Uh. <laughs> points like clean. Oh, can we try that at home? Hey, tell me about it, eh? Louis, Wilder's here, mate. Tilly, Dolly, what am I? Me, how to? Oh, Kira. Hey. Hi, Tilly, how are you? Oh, wishing my phone wasn't so ancient. Oh, take clothes, eh? We've all been there. So, should I just. Oh, uh, Dolly, show him through, please. I'm off to work, guys. See you later. Yeah, I'm off as well. Text me later. Yes, boss. Yep. Yeah. What's up with the phone? Oh, it's just crap. Crap about UI connectivity. All I'm trying to do is get into my socials, but it won't. Have you tried deleting and redownloading? Well, I'm not a total noob. It's just junk. The battery's pancakes and the storage jams up. Sucks. But I'll keep nagging Dad for a new one. He'll break eventually. <sighs> Gunshot wound to the head, no exit wound. GCS of 9, heart rate of 60, blood pressure 140 over 90. Through to restart. Hamish, what the hell? No, they got shot. What, what about you? But, uh, it's not mine, I'm, I'm fine. I, is she? I don't know, I have to get in there. People's are sluggish. Ngadi, can you hear me? Prep for intubation? Yes, please. Ngadi, you're in hospital, you're safe, okay? Call Lisa, we need a surgical consult instead. She's arrested. Come on, Whitey. You got this. Um, can you pass me the socket wrench stuff, please? It's just on the seat. It's next to the hooker with the prairie dog. What? Oh, it's fine, I've got it. But as penance, you have to tell me where you were just then. Nowhere. Mm-hmm. How do you get a girl to like you? Ah. Uh. Age-old question, right? Ooh. Well, is this a girl in particular? Because if it's Tilly, then oh. you know. Good. Mm, totally. Because her and Arepa seem pretty tight. I know. Hmm. OK, uh, well, start with the basics. Are you on speaking terms with this, this girl? I mean, barely. She knows who I am. OK, well, that's a start. Now you just need to figure out how to get her to talk to you, you know, find out what she likes. What if she doesn't talk back or thinks I'm a dick? Well, then you have to show her that you're not. You do something cool. But, you know, you've got you've to use your spidey sense as well, and if you're not getting a, hey, this guy's cool, I'd love to keep talking to him vibe, then you just got to respect that and back off. Or if that doesn't work, uh, you could sing to her in assembly or get a, you know, a massive present. She'll have to notice you after that. Like jewellery or a car? No. Or a phone? No, are you made of money? <laughs> Maybe. Hmm. Can you share some with me? How much adrenaline has she had? Three milligrams and 300 amiodarone. She actually has no output. I'm so sorry. Charge the 200, I'm not letting her die. Yeah. Just do it. Clear. Come on, Lydia, work with me. Jack is right. Wait. <sighs> She has a pulse. I don't believe it. <sighs> Holy hell. OK, let's get her to theatre. She might have a chance yet. God is watching over you today, Jack. Nice job. Mm. Oh. Weren't you? I went away and came back. Oh, I'll go get Louis. Oh, wait, um, I wanted to talk to you. Oh. So I know you hate me and that. I never said that. Well, you know, things went a bit salty. Yeah. And if I could change it, I would, but, you know, having a few kinks with a space-time continuum. Huh? I got you something. What is it? No way. Are you kidding me? Not having a phone is like not having an elbow. No. Oh, wow. Um, <clears throat> Aripa might not be cool with this. This is kind of a big deal. It was unspecial, and, you know, you're a mate. OK, well... Oh, my God. Thank you. Can you help me set it up? Of course. Nice. So what are you up to today? Oh, I don't know. Well, we could check out that VR thing at the museum. You know, some other time I might text Tilly. Of course. Tilly, eh? So? Did you two get to talk much yesterday? Not really, but... It's better? Yeah. Awesome. You hungry? Rhetorical question, right? <laughs> Morena. Hi. Morena, come in. Thank you. <sighs> Darling, 
Dad says I have to get this back. I'm not allowed. Sorry, what is this? Ah, uh, the phone that Walter bought her. That, that's too much. Hang on, you... You gave this to her? Whoa. Well, her phone's mounted, so... How did you pay for it? Why can't she keep it? Uh, it's too expensive for me. She's a mate and had some spare cash. So. Spare cash? That's a few thousand bucks right there. Yeah, well, look, I'm, I'm sure Wilder had good intentions. Sure, sure, um, but I don't feel comfortable, so I'll give it back, eh? Uh, thanks anyway, mate. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry to bother you guys. No, not at all. See ya. Bye. Oh, she's a May and I saw a good deal. And the money? Just use some savings. That's a big spend. Can you see how it was a bit inappropriate? It's my money. I should be able to do what I want with it. Bringing the up. Saskia hasn't been giving him money. Just our usual agreed stuff. So when he says savings... Well, he wouldn't have that much, would he? It's a hell of a lot to drop on one present. But he's acting like it's no big deal. Oh, Wilder, can you come down here, please? Just as you were trying to get back on track. What? We hadn't finished talking. This is about it. stupid fun. You said you used your savings. Yeah. Even though you don't have a job. I mean, Christmas money, birthday money, it adds up. Well, do you have more? Or did that clean you out? You're my accountant now. Do I need to be? Look, I don't know why everyone's so flipped about this. TK doesn't like it. I'll go take the phone and sell it. End of story, right? <sighs> oh, She's a gonna say this. Yours cracking? Well, Zaskia will be loving this. Last time I called her, it was about weed. Now I'm calling her about money. You don't think what are the two are related? Well, it's stoner guys at school. Crap, he's dealing. <laughs> 